Tripoli ceasefire called by Turkey and Russia came into force on Sunday. A ceasefire called by Turkey and Russia took hold for the second day in the Libyan capital Tripoli on Monday amid talks between warring rivals in Moscow. The ceasefire came into force on Sunday amid accusations by both sides of violating the agreement. The UN-recognized government said civilian was killed by forces loyal to renegade commander Khalifa Haftar southeast of Tripoli. Gunfire was also reported in Salahuddin district in the Libyan capital. Our forces are fully committed to the ceasefire, but are on alert on respond to any breach by Haftar's forces, commander of the UN-recognized government's forces told Anadolu Agency. On Monday, Fayez al sarraj the head of the internationally recognized government, and Haftar, who is based in eastern Libya, arrived in Moscow for talks aimed at resolving the Libyan crisis. In April, Haftar launched an offensive to capture Tripoli from the UN-recognized government. According to the UN, more than 1,000 people have been killed since the start of the operation and more than 5,000 others injured. Since the ouster of late leader Muammar Gaddafi in 2011, two seats of power have emerged in Libya, one in eastern Libya supported mainly by Egypt and the United Arab Emirates and the other in Tripoli, which enjoys UN and international recognition. Asterisk Ahmed Asmar contributed to this report from Ankara.